we're back with Membership Monday. Today we're at Carolina Gardens of Conway with Executive Director Jason Taylor. We're going to learn a little more about what Carolina Gardens offers here for the people that live here. So Jason, what kind of services do you offer here? Well, we have uh, really three different levels of service. Um, we have, uh, it's an overall assisted living, but we have three different types. We have an independent style of assisted living, mm -hmm. we have more of an enhanced style of assisted living, and then we're able to bring to the community a memory care which um, I do believe we're one of the only people in Conway that has memory care for assisted living. And what exactly is memory care? So memory care is residents who have Alzheimer's or dementia, can no longer live safely at home, or uh, they may be at another assisted living and no longer meet the requirements that, okay. uh, that they have. And so we're able to offer a uh, higher level of care for those residents here without having to go to a skilled nursing. Okay. And how many residents can you house in this we're licensed uh, for 100 beds, but we only have 86 openings current, or 86 beds to be filled. Okay. Um, we, uh, we have uh, the extra because husband and wives and couples who come in too. So that way uh, there's sometimes two, three people in a room. Okay. So about the independent living, can I explain more about that so they don't have as much care? How does that work? Um, with the independent living, uh, some people just aren't safe at home. They either need help with their medications, they need help with their driving, um, and they, they can't live at home by themselves. And okay. so what they do is they come here and we try to uh, help fill the gaps. So they're still independent, they can drive, they can do what they need to, um, and they can still live their normal lives. We had, um, or we had a man who uh, still had a job while he was here. Oh, wow. So he just couldn't prepare his meals and he was a little forgetful about making sure he was taking his meds, but he actually still worked at a golf course. Oh, and, cool. and so that's kind of what we want to get out there that, you know, assisted living is not uh, a nursing home type of thing. It's assistance for seniors who need it. Right, mm -hmm. and so, um, what kind of activities do you offer here? Do, do they get to go out? Can family members come in and interact them? How does that work? Yeah, so uh, residents can come and go as they please. Uh, family members can come and take their loved ones for extended periods of time if, they, if they'd like to. Um, there's nothing that, that holds a resident back unless they have some kind of cognitive impairment. I gotcha. Mm -hmm. um, and so you said you do have open beds right now. How would a family bring a loved one in here? Well, uh, just give us a call. Um, uh, our marketing director, his name is uh, Neil Hendrick, okay. um, and you would just give him a call at 843-397-1010, okay. and uh, we'd be more than happy to discuss options with um, with any families, or even if they just want information and pre-planning. That's the biggest thing that we see. A lot of people, um, they don't plan well for right. the future, right. and so, you know, jumping at, uh, being ahead of the curve is definitely, uh, will save you a lot of stress in the long run. Right. And I know it can be hard to um, mentally prepare yourself for putting a loved one here. So it's, it is nice you can come tour the place. Like you said, give Neil Hendricks a call. Um, feel free to come look. And the place is amazing. It's beautiful here. You guys Thank have you. done an awesome job. Thank you. Um, so if you are looking for somewhere to put a loved one that needs a little extra help, um, feel free to stop by and give them a call. They're here to help you. Thank you. Thanks.